God, I look like I'm about to serve you a terrible martini. Hello, dear friends. Today, we're gonna do something a little bit different from normal. I'm going to show you all how to tie a bow tie. Being able to tie a real bow tie is a bit of a forgotten art. These days, everyone just has the clip-on ones, the elastic ones, but a real bow tie still has connotations of being a bit more, you know, dapper and classy and fedora tipping intensifiers, my man. Some people might even say it's impressive, which is weird because it's not like it's particularly hard, it's just that no one really learns how to do it. The reason that I know how to tie a bow tie is because when I was 19, I thought to myself, I'm a strong girl, I can do whatever the boys can do. What's something that I can learn really quickly that most men don't know how to do? So I learned to tie a bow tie. And let me tell you, there is a lot of satisfaction to be gained from being asked to tie a man's bow tie for him because he doesn't know how to do it himself. Which has happened to me on more than one occasion. Two, two occasions. Two. But it's still a very good feeling to be able to tie a bow tie. It's kind of like a party trick. And you don't have to be a man to wear a bow tie these days. You know what? You don't even have to be a woman. It's 2019, baby. Androgyny is in. So let's get into it. This is how to tie a bow tie. Step one, the first thing you're gonna need to do is to get a bow tie. What I did was went to eBay and searched up bow ties by cheapest and I got a whole bunch of like little $2 bow ties from China. Now those bow ties were the worst quality. They were awful sizes made of this horrible slippery polyester material, really hard to tie. But you know what? If you can manage to successfully tie one of the worst bow ties that Chinese factories can produce, then you can make any bow tie look good. This, on the other hand, is a decent bow tie. Step two is to pop the collar, because we want to be 20% cooler. Look at that, a brony joke. Fedora tipping really does intensify, huh? Next, you're gonna need to drape the bow tie over your shoulders, and you want to leave one end short and one end really long. Next, what we're gonna do is cross the long end over the short end, just at the point where the short end starts tapering bigger. So just about here. Now I realize my shirt's a little bit ill-fitting, so you'll just have to excuse that. Next, we're gonna grab the long end again and push it up through the cross at the back. So basically we've just tied a knot here. What we're gonna do next is let the long end go, grab the shorter end, and at the smallest part here, we're going to cross this over the front to make a bow shape. Now we're gonna grab the long end again, fold it over the front, and this is where it gets a little bit fiddly. We're gonna push this through the back to make a bow. We're just gonna make a knot. There's a little hole at the back here, a little loop that we made when we crossed it over. We're just gonna grab this and push it through that hole out to the other side. Like that, there it is there. Now at the moment, it's starting to resemble a bow tie, but it's a pretty messy bow tie. So for the next few minutes, what we need to do is grab the loop here, the loop at the back, grab them and pull, and then undo it a little bit. Grab and pull, undo a little bit. And we just need to do that for the next few minutes until it starts resembling a more bow tie shape. So we're just tightening everything up by tightening and bringing it back into shape, tightening, bringing back into shape. We just do that over and over and over again until what you have resembles a bow tie. Make it look neat and tidy. I'm gonna push it down onto my ill-fitting collar here. Fold the collar back over. This is tricky without a mirror. I'm just gonna fix everything up again so it's all in line and in shape. And then we have a bow tie. It will definitely take a few tries to get right. It definitely took me a few weeks to get right the first time. But once you can tie a bow tie, you feel like the most dapper kid on the block. Fedora tipping intensifies to over 9,000. And there we have it. That is how to tie a bow tie. Thank you for joining me on this tutorial for Forgotten Arts of Dapperness. I upload fresh videos every single Friday, so subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you all next week on Friday. Arabella, out. It's